Had a lot of nice weather over the last couple of days as well. Mm -hmm. That is about to change in a few ways. It's going to get a little warmer. It's going to get a little bit more humid, and we're going to talk about that possibility for a few storms to impact our forecast, not necessarily from what you see there, although this will have some impact on our forecast for today, just not necessarily bringing us storms. And I'll explain what I mean by that. We have dry air in place, and that dry air is not going to be eroded so quickly as this arrives. Notice a lot of it is falling apart, and we expect that to continue, although some of the high thin clouds may overspread the area could make for a beautiful sunrise for many of you again we'll, we'll just watch this to see how much of this system survives regardless it is going to add a little bit more moisture to our forecast here's the latest future cast run again notice that kind of dries out once we get into the afternoon if you were watching earlier by the way this future cast run brought in some showers and storms at 5 p.m and i said you know what i'm not going to jump on this just yet because i think the air is too dry the new future cast run literally just came in this is the first time i'm looking at it and it takes those showers and storms out that's why i didn't make a knee-jerk reaction to that so to speak but still a few more clouds. It is bringing the showers in a little bit later tonight, and then we'll have high pressure try to build in for the early part of the day. Here is 1 p.m. when the eclipse is ongoing. I still think we'll have a mix of sun and clouds, although we'll probably be increasing the clouds once we get into the uh, afternoon, the late afternoon, and into the evening before we watch this next system bring us a chance for storms on your Tuesday. Again, you add the heat and humidity, you've got to add the chance for storms in there, and that's exactly what we've done for mainly the second half of Monday, although we may be adjusting this slightly with some of that new data and then especially on Tuesday. For now, I'm going to leave Sunday's forecast alone. I'm going to call it partly cloudy skies, although watch for a few isolated showers or storms later tonight or overnight into Monday. After that, it's much cooler, it's much quieter, and it's definitely going to feel much less humid by the time we get into next week. All right. Thanks, Rob.